Frankenstein typically refers to the fictional character created by Mary Shelley in her novel Frankenstein, or The Modern Prometheus, published in 1818. The full title of the novel suggests its themes of scientific hubris and the consequences of playing God. In the story, Victor Frankenstein is a young scientist who creates a sentient creature through an unorthodox scientific experiment. The creature, often referred to as Frankenstein's monster or simply the monster, is brought to life using various body parts from different corpses. Despite Victor's initial excitement and ambition, he is horrified by the appearance of his creation and rejects the creature. The novel explores themes of morality, responsibility, and the consequences of tampering with the natural order. Frankenstein's monster, often misunderstood and rejected by society, becomes a tragic figure seeking revenge against his creator. It's worth noting that the name Frankenstein is commonly used to refer to the monster itself, even though in the original work, Frankenstein is the creator, not the creature. The novel has had a significant impact on popular culture and has inspired numerous adaptations, films, and other creative works over the years. Frankenstein and its characters have been adapted into numerous movies over the years, with various interpretations and portrayals. Here's an overview of the history of Frankenstein in film. 1. Early silent films, 1910s to 1920s. The first film adaptation of Frankenstein was a silent, short film made in 1910 by Edison Studios. It was a loose adaptation and only ran for about 16 minutes. There were a few other silent adaptations in the 1920s, including Life Without Soul, 1915, and The Monster of Frankenstein, 1920. 2. Universal Pictures, 1930s to 1940s. The most iconic portrayal of Frankenstein's monster comes from the Universal Pictures series in the 1930s, starting with Frankenstein, 1931, directed by James Whale. Boris Karloff played the creature in this in the sequel, Bride of Frankenstein, 1935, solidifying the monster's appearance with a flat head, neck bolts, and a lumbering walk. The series continued with several more sequels, including Son of Frankenstein, 1939, and Ghost of Frankenstein, 1942. 3. Hammer Horror Films, 1950s to 1970s. Hammer Film Productions produced a series of Frankenstein films, starting with The Curse of Frankenstein, 1957. Peter Cushing played Victor Frankenstein in these films, and Christopher Lee played the monster. This series had a more gothic and lurid style compared to the Universal films. 4. Other Adaptations, 20th Century. Various other adaptations and parodies were made throughout the 20th century, ranging from horror to comedy. Notable examples include Young Frankenstein, 1974, a comedic take directed by Mel Brooks. The Japanese film Frankenstein Conquers the World, 1965, features a different take, with the monster facing off against other kaiju creatures. 5. Modern Era, Late 20th Century to Present Numerous films, both direct adaptations and reimaginings, have been made in recent decades. Examples include Kenneth Branagh's Mary Shelley's Frankenstein, 1994, which attempted to be more faithful to the original novel, and Victor Frankenstein, 2015, which took a different perspective on the story. 6. Animated and Science Fiction Adaptations Asterisk Frankenstein has appeared in various animated and science fiction adaptations, including in The Monster Squad 1987 and Van Helsing 2004. These are just a few highlights, and the story of Frankenstein continues to be a popular and enduring subject for filmmakers exploring themes of science, morality, and the consequences of playing God. The character has become an iconic figure in popular culture, transcending the original novel and influencing various forms of media.